that? Robots? There are tons of them. They all have the Big Bang Burger logo. They're saying something. You must adhere to your shifts. If you don't like it, you can quit. However, you will not be compensated. What are they talking about? Oh! They said it's being disposed of. These robots are part of Okumura's cognition, correct? That means they represent... True. That's what they appear to be externally. However, this is most likely how the workers of Okumura Foods are viewed by their CEO. So he thinks they're his robots? If they're treated like this in reality as well, then the company truly is exploiting them. See? Okumura is a piece of shit, just like I said! Mona is our main objective here. He doesn't seem to be anywhere nearby. Let's search further in. Damn it. <sighs> I can see it. Look at it. There's no way we can force that thing open. We've hit a blockade quite early. But we have to control the real Okumura's cognition to pass. Oh, that means Mona hasn't been able to proceed any further either. So if he's here in the palace, he would have to be somewhere before this door. Halt, vigilante! Who's that? <sighs> Close. Could she be? A black mask? Wait, is she the one Madarame and Kanashiro were talking about? So, she's the reason for all those people going brain dead? It was a girl this whole time? <sighs> Are you the one who has been following us? Say something, damn it! <laughs> Enough of your misunderstandings. Mona! You're okay! Long time no see, Panther. Uh, hasn't been that long. If you came for the treasure, you should just go home with your tail between your legs. Actually, we were looking for you. The treasure will be taken by me, and this... This beauty thief! Beauty thief? I'll have you know, she's a Persona user, too. My name is Beauty Thief! She really called herself that? Uh, any tension that was in the air has just gone out the window. We will take the treasure! Mona already said that. You are not qualified to be Phantom Thieves! Do you even understand what it means to be a Phantom Thief? An admirable phantom thief is... Yeah, tell them! You! What do you think it means? Yes, that's... right? Enough with the idle chit-chat! You started it. Mona, who the hell is she? Wait, I'll fix this! Me? Learn to take a hint! Huh? And you, you're very vulgar and very stupid! What? Um... What 
What was it again? You came all the way here just to say that. I don't know. Kind of feels like she ain't dangerous at all. We will take the treasure. You already said that. We don't have time to chat. No point. It won't open. Don't underestimate us. Behind you! Here they come. Huh? Huh? Snap out of it. We need to go. We'll meet up later at our usual spot. Let's hurry. Bet you're tired. Uh, that was quite rough. I haven't felt exhaustion like this since I first awakened to my persona. What have you been looking at all this time? Sorry, I just didn't want to stand around and wait. The burglary at Okumura Foods is circulating the news again. Ugh, damn it! Why'd they keep coming after only me? Because Little Miss Beauty Thief opened that door. That door most likely had a biometric authentication lock. So how'd she get it to open? I wonder who that girl could be. We were told that she's a Persona user, correct? Do you believe it's true? Well, she did look like one. Did Mona betray us? No. I don't think he's betrayed us. If he had, it'd make more sense for him to directly threaten us, such as exposing our identities. Either way, how the hell's Morgana related to that beauty thief? Considering her tone and physique, she looked about our age. I feel like I've seen her somewhere. Uh, for real? Where at? At school, I think? Wait, what? But, now that you mention it, I feel like I've seen her, too. Is she a student of Shujin? I just feel like that's the case. She did have a mask on, after all. The registry in the student council room has photos of every student. Let's check them all tomorrow. If we can figure out the identity of the beauty thief, that may help us regain contact with Morgana. Futaba and I should further probe into Okumura Foods, then. It'd be best if we investigate how sudden mental shutdowns are connected to them. We're gonna take them down.
Man, this girl's hot! Ah, but she's younger than me. Ryuji! No way! She's the same age as me? She looks like my dad's friend. Get back to work. Why don't we take a break? It's no surprise our concentration is waning. Even if it's only the female students, there are easily hundreds of them. They're all starting to look the same to me. Think we can really find her? You can say that again. Hmm? This girl! Haru Okumura. Okumura? Wasn't the beauty thief like this too? Especially the fluffy hair. That's gotta be her. It would also explain how she got past the door's biometric reader. This may be worth looking into. But why was she at the palace? We could just make her spill the beans herself. She may have already gone home for the day, so let's try tomorrow. I'm gonna lock up. I'll see you all tomorrow. Yet, I'm Haru Okumura, correct? The only daughter of Kunikazu Okumura, CEO of Okumura Foods. Care to explain why you are inside your father's palace? Oh, so that's where we met. Wow, you figured it out in just a day. You looked really good in that biker gang outfit. Let's not talk about that. So, why did you become a phantom thief? <sighs> My father's highly regarded as a manager, but I had various... doubts about him. Things have grown quite serious lately. That's why I want to make amends, even though it may only be for my own satisfaction. But I wonder if this is just running from the problem. Where did you meet Morgana? It was pure coincidence. I found a lonely looking cat in front of me. And that was Morgana? Mm hmm. And when I followed him, I ended up in the metaverse. There's no way for me to change my father's company. But if I became a phantom thief, I thought I'd at least be able to change him. Isn't there any way we can work together? I can't cooperate with people who don't know what they want to do. What you're doing is unnecessarily causing a stir among the public. Besides, the phantom thieves who should be helping the weak are not helping their own teammate. Uh. I just want my father to atone for his crimes, and help Monachan who gave me a chance to do just that. But aren't our objectives the same? It'd be better if we were... No thank you. I will do this with Monachan and him alone. She hit quite a sore spot. We don't know what we want to do, huh? It seems getting her cooperation won't be possible. Let's consult with the others on our next move. We shouldn't ignore Morgana, either. I'm home, Father. Drive them away. That's right. Make it a priority. I finally get a foothold into politics, and this happens. Phantom thieves? Huh. Did the media ask you anything? No, not at all. Um, 
What's this about phantom thieves? It seems I'm ranked first on the forum of these so-called phantom thieves. Is it because of the news coverage? It's jealousy of the successful. Nothing but the barks of the masses who lack the resolve to sacrifice what's needed for their well-being. Both the young and the old are overjoyed with some foolish idols. This country has no future. What if they do exist? What if these phantom thieves really can steal hearts? Are you still having doubts about me? No. More importantly, I hope things are going well with that young man. Yes, father. Very well, then. He may not seem like it, but he's still the son of an influential politician. Be cordial with him. He'll eventually become a necessary connection for this company. Or rather, for me. I understand. I will do the best I can. Good. That's how a daughter of Okumura should be. I can't believe it!
Let's hear it. This is it. Good. You're going to apologize when Mona comes, all right? I know already. And, and why are you just saying that to me? We need to be wary of the beauty thief, too. So we're doing a stakeout here. We'd better be ready for the long haul. Ain't he gonna show up today? I mean, what time is it now? Hold that thought. You guys are seriously slacking off way too much! Do you have business with us? Aren't you fulfilling the requests on the Phantom Aficionado website? Even leaving comments? It'd be best if you don't accept them so recklessly. The police will track you down in no time. If that were to happen, we'd be caught up in it as well. Uh, that's not what I intended! But that would be my fault. I'm actually not that great with machines. I'm truly sorry. Why are you apologizing? They're telling us for our sake. We should be thanking them. Won't you please put what happened behind us? So I'm the one you're here for? You guys need me after all? Is that it? Really? Ryuji! We're sorry too, Morgana. We weren't taking your feelings into consideration at all. Lady On. Uh, everyone? Shouldn't you be using code names? Ryuji didn't really mean what he said, you know? He wants to apologize. Well, it's like... It was my bad too. I mean, I don't mind if you're not human or if you're useless. What a douche. On setup was completely ruined. Oh, is that right? So I am just some useless cat to you guys. 
You're so full of yourselves, but do you have the skills to back that up? Try and catch me, then! Get in, beauty thief! If you can't do this, don't count on me ever coming back. There they go. Did he even think about how long he made us wait? Fine! We'll do this! Jeez, this isn't what we came here to do. All right! Piece of cake. Hear us out, Morgana. There's nothing I have to talk to you about. Come on. There's no need to keep being so stubborn. I can't just give in like this. I have my pride to protect. <gasps> What's that over there? Huh? Seems we've fallen for the oldest trick in the book. Ah, those two. It'll never end at this rate. What do we do now? I don't hear the sound of his engine at all. Could they have left Mementos? Her lack of vehicle puts us at a severe disadvantage. We should probably just head home for today. Damn it! Freaking Morgana! Are you sure that was what you wanted? Of course it was. You made me look everywhere for you. What were you doing somewhere without any reception? Out late with guys, that's it, isn't it? I would never do such a thing! Come on, let me have some fun too, will ya? Can't you do that for me? Uh! Haru! You little... Let go of Haru! Ah! Uh, what the... Goddamn cat! Yeah! Mama-chan! Damn it. I am useless. Someone... Anyone... Is anybody out there? Will you shut up, you stupid cat? Damn that Morgana! He is so getting it the next time we run into him. Um, buddy? Was that Mona's voice? Hey, over there! That doesn't seem right to me. Please! Uh, let go! Pokumara-san! Mona! What are you doing 
to our friend! Sorry about the disturbance. It's just a lover's quarrel with my fiance. Fian... What? But she's clearly fighting you! How dare you make a fool of me? I'll be telling your father about this too. I won't forget your faces. Are you okay? I'm fine, but Mona-chan... This is nothing. Was that person really your fiancé? Whoa, so you're engaged then? That didn't seem like an ordinary fight though. Shouldn't you talk to your parents about it? I think it'd be useless. I'll just be told to beg for his forgiveness. Even if it means groveling on the ground. <laughs> it seems she has her reasons. I'll, um, apologize about what happened earlier. So, would you let Haru rest for a while? Of course. We'll take her to your place, yeah? Thanks. Did you get enough rest? Mona-chan? Anyway, it's just as I told you a moment ago. I can't have you guys risk your lives anymore for someone useless like me. To be frank, there's no assurance that I'll turn back into a human either. This can't be called a fair deal. That's why I think we should split up. <laughs> Who said we're acting as phantom thieves for your sake? I'm doing it to expand my own horizons. No need to tiptoe around the situation. We're splitting up. You should stop lying. Do you remember what you said to me when I found you collapsed in the metaverse? That you're a phantom thief. That you're going to get stronger and have the others acknowledge you. You love being here. Don't you? Of course not! I was lying to myself too. But when I formed a contract with my persona, I understood it all. Doing this because my father is doing something horrible was nothing but a superficial reason. The truth is, I... Don't want to get married, right? I thought that since an adult with responsibilities made the decision, it couldn't be wrong. I was such a fool. Tied down by vague notions and stayed quiet as my marriage partner was chosen. But I won't tolerate this anymore. I can't stand that creep! <sighs> That's how I truly feel. Why are you looking at me all of a sudden? Mona-chan, why is it that you always talked about becoming human again? That's... At first, I only thought of this team as a temporary dwelling until I regained my memories. But I wasn't making any progress on finding out what I am or why I was born. Morgana... I wanted a reason of my own. A reason to stay with the Phantom Thieves. I don't have anyone I want to save or get revenge on. Someone like me has no reason to stay here. That's why. To me, this team is... Come on, say it. You can do it. It's the only place I can belong. I want to stay here forever. That was refreshingly honest. <laughs> you should have just said so from the start. Jeez. If you stick with me, there's no telling what kind of trouble will come up. You better be sure about this. It's a little late for all that, don't you think? Of course we want to stay with you, too. <clears throat> uh, so... Well... I'm sorry I worried you guys. This is where I belong. 
My mind's all set. I'll make sure to work hard to pay my dues. It's too late to cancel our deal, got it? We're reforming our give and take deal. Wouldn't you say that your encounter with us was destiny? That's right. Encounter. Hmm? Oh crap! The last train's coming up! I must go as well. Let's continue this another time. I... Stay at our place. I'll arrange it. See you all tomorrow! I'm gonna sleep. I'm exhausted. Man, this place is as drab as always. going on here? You brought over another girl? That's not what I meant. Anyway, don't break her heart, all right? So, you found our cat and even took care of it. Oh, it wasn't a bother or anything. I'm the one who took care of you, though. <laughs> What's up? You seem happy. It's been a while since I've had a meal with so many people. Make sure you go home today before it gets too late, okay? I'm sure your parents are worried. It's fine if you don't want to go home either, you know? No, I'll go home. If my father suspects something, it'll be more difficult to change his heart, wouldn't it? I'll contact you again, so... Oh, right! Can we exchange contact info? Will you be okay on your own? If you need, I can go with you. You belong here, don't you, Monachan? Well, yeah. The matter's been settled. You'll be welcomed into his household. Excuse me? You won't officially be registered yet, but isn't that how things are with young people these days? Go prove your sincerity to him. You can do that, can't you? So, I'm not even allowed to decide where I will live, am I? Not only do you come home late, you even stayed out overnight without permission. I thought I had been clear about the friends you choose. Father, they're not like... I have my hands full right now with the company. Don't cause any more trouble for me. Hello. Yes, it's fine. Go on. Hello? I need to discuss something with everyone. Can we all meet?
what could be wrong? I wonder why she wants to talk to us. Horrible. It's that same fiance guy, right? You know what's going to happen. Based on what Haru just told us, she'll be taken to his house on October 11th. That means our deadline is the 10th. But if we trigger a change of heart in your father, he'll definitely be taken by the police. The label of a criminal's daughter will forever stick with you. Your current living situation may change as well. If I accept a happiness based on the misfortune of others, I'll be no better than my father. And to be honest, I've actually left a request on the Phantom Aficionado website before. She did so around the time we were mulling over who to target next. But the Phantom Thieves didn't make a move. That's when I met Mona-chan. I thought it was fate. I made my decision then. If the Phantom Thieves wouldn't act, I'd do it myself. The mental shutdowns, treasure, and finally, the change of heart. Our interests have come together. Would you cooperate with us now? Of course! I should be the one cordially asking to be allowed on the team. From here on, we may be going up against the culprit behind those mental shutdown occurrences. This will be different from our training in Mementos. You better brace yourselves. You're suddenly lecturing us? You're too naive. Haru's barely a hair better than an amateur. She's awakened to her powers, but it's weak. Even her persona is lacking a solid form at the moment. Weak? Really? She can transform at the very least, but to be frank, she may slow us down. A lot. I'm sorry for causing such trouble. Nah, don't worry about it. It's actually convenient for us to target that CEO. Check out this news blog. There's a lot of negative comments in regard to the Phantom Thieves. The names of obvious criminals have come up, so why haven't the Phantom Thieves acted yet? The way they're getting heated is on a different level. Don't forget about the intel on the mental shutdown cases, all right? Of course! We'll get them both! October, uh, 10th, was it? We're gonna change Okumura's heart by then! I can't forgive them! Oh, you want to do it? Okay. Yeah! Yes. Yeah.